This is a strawberry shortcake. It's keto, low carb, and it's delicious. It's layers of my vanilla sponge cake and strawberry jam, as well as some vanilla frosting and some strawberries, fresh strawberries to decorate on top. All of the ingredients and the description of the recipe are going to be listed below under the description box of this video. You've already seen how I make my vanilla sponge on my tiramisu video, but I will add it here as well. So we're gonna start with some frozen strawberries. If you don't have frozen, you can use fresh. I like frozen. It's gonna be about eight ounces. And we're going to go ahead and cook these on the stove top with some erythritol. That's my sweetener of choice, but if you guys like another type of sweetener, you can use that. I'm using powdered. You can also use granulated sweetener since you're cooking it on the stove, so it won't. It'll dissolve. I like to use the frozen strawberries because they really do have uh, better flavor, in my opinion, and they usually um, look much more radiant. I don't know. They look more red. They're beautiful. So you're just gonna cook this on the stove for about 10 to 12 minutes. Uh, I let the uh, sweetener dissolve and I decided I wanted a little bit sweeter, so I'm gonna add some liquid stevia, about 15 drops. And once you add your sweeteners and uh, cook it up a little bit, you wanna taste it to see if, um, if you wanna add more sweetener or not. But keep in mind, once this cools down, it's going to be sweeter, okay? So you don't have to add that much sweetener after you taste it and, and you can tell it's, it's got good sweetness, just kind of let it sit. Uh, once this cooks and uh, reduce a little bit, you're gonna see it's gonna get thicker and then you're just gonna have put it aside and let it cool down. See how thick it got here? And there's my vanilla frosting that I also made to layer it. If you don't wanna bother with the vanilla frosting, you can just use whipped cream and that'll work fine as well. So you're gonna start out with the sponge on the bottom, the strawberry jam, it's gonna be the first layer, and then you're gonna follow it by that uh, strawberry frosting or whipped cream, if that's what you're using. You're gonna put in another sponge layer, more of that strawberry jam. And here I'm showing you how I made my second one. And this recipe is gonna be enough for four of these. These are four inch ramekins. But if you wanna make more than that, you can always just double the recipe. And so you're gonna finish the dessert by putting some of the vanilla frosting on top or whipped cream again, if that's what you have. And you can decorate these with um, some fresh strawberries once you get ready to eat them. You can see I had leftover of the ingredients. And here it is with the strawberries on top. You guys, it's really delicious. Thanks for watching. I hope you try it.